Didn't I tell y'all this? I think it was around Christmas. I was home with my parents. And I said, and everybody was getting at me. Everybody on the Reddit, everybody in the comments, everybody on Instagram, Twitter. I was like, yo, this Homicide Gang album just sounds like a whole lot of red beats. Maybe like a tad more, uh, let's say, updated to the Cardi type filthy beats because we don't really know like okay so that was what 2022 that it released therefore cardi since 2020 he's on, rapping on newer stuff where we get little glimpses of it from like medusa rockstar some of these newer songs that leak or that he plays snippets of at rolling loud but i was like this sounds like you know just a a worse version of cardi and and this is i'm not saying this is bad but like it's getting carried by the production and it's just like what what and it's like if i want that i would just go for cardi similar thing to ken although ken has his own sound now but still like i don't know man just as much as the cardi effect this is something that i'm starting to think about cardi has a very strong cosign in homicide gang destroy lonely ken carson have all and filthy and they've all his artists specifically though they've all benefited from this However, it's up to them really to keep that hype going, to make quality music. And I just don't know if Homicide Gang is really going to continue with the quality. Like, this is okay again, but, and, and, and you know what? The fans are probably going to deride regardless just because it's Cardi fans. And you know how they are. And I'm not hating on them. They can listen to whatever they want. But it's just not going to go that big if they just continue on this this is mid i'm sorry this is mid in the sense that it's a lot of people think that mid is like bad it's not bad like it's palatable and at a if they were performing it it would be hype for sure but like come on the, the flows were just basic i don't remember anything except for the what what but again cardi does that or did that back in the day sorry bro also with the allegations that they got you know, I don't know if they can make it. Well, I, I think they can make it out regardless because they don't really, they're, they're not taking it seriously. I always say, if you're getting canceled, you're not canceled until you cancel yourself. Like the worst thing you can do is just, I don't know about respond because you don't necessarily need to respond. But if you, if you just continue creating content or releasing, like that's why when Lil Mosey just went dark, I was like, yo, why are you like, you're just letting people think that you did it. Like, you need to be in the public eye to let people know, yo, I didn't do this. It's only Bino stop saying they. I mean, yeah, they're boys. If your boy, if your boy is messing with 14 year olds and you're, you know, in your 20s, are you chilling with that boy? Be real with me right now. Because I'm not. See, we're trying to go to the bar and he's trying to go to like, Chuck E. Cheese or something? Come on. I ain't doing that.